again in this problem a uniform 40 kg scaffold of length 6 meters so the scaffold is 40 kgs and it's 6 meters long is supported by two light cables as shown an 80 kg painter stands 1 meter from the left end of the scaffold this is 1 meter and his painting equipment is 1.5 meters from the right end if the tension in the left cable is twice in the right cable find the tensions of the cable and the mass of the equipment Okay, so we'll call this tension T, so this is 2T. This is 1 meter mg, mg, and this is the mass of the scaffold. Okay, so uh, for equilibrium, we need this to be true, and uh, we want the torques to be true. Okay. So, um, so let's write down these two equations. Okay, so 2t plus t minus mg minus ms stick g minus mg should equal zero so 3t equal to m plus ms plus mg okay that's one equation now to calculate the torques here's what we'll do um, so to calculate the torque, uh, let's be smart about this. We don't know this mass, so what we'll do is we'll calculate the torques about this point, thereby eliminating this guy. And everything else is known, so we can calculate tau. Okay, so let's do the torques about this equation, about this axis. And uh, this distance is 1.5 meters. Okay, so we're doing the sum of the torque equation equal to zero and um, any this guy is ro would make the uh, scaffold rotate counterclockwise about this axis this would make him rotate counterclockwise counterclockwise they're all positive terms torques this would make the scaffold rotate clockwise about this point and that would be a negative torque okay so let's and the moment term for this guy is 6 meters minus 1.5, so that's 4.5 meters. Okay. So 2t, oops, that's the only negative torque, so minus 2t times 4.5 meters. And the other torques are positive, so plus t times 1.5. 5 meters plus mass of the stick which is uh, mass of the scaffold which is 40 kgs times 9.8 meters per second square and this is uh, that's 3 meters this is the scaffold is six meters long, so this is three meters. Since that's one point five meters, this is also one point five meters. One point five meters plus uh, the man weighs eighty kgs, eighty kgs times nine point eight meters per second square, and the moment arm for the man is this is one meter, so this is this is two meters plus one and a half, 3.5 meters. So this distance is 3.5 meters. Okay. And this should add up to zero. Okay, so tension is the only unknown in this equation and we should be able to solve this. Okay, let me simplify this. <coughs> so this is a minus nine T uh, plus 1.5 t so 7.5 t is equal to the rest of the stuff 
Okay, so this is equal to 40. So so the tension is given by 3332 divided by 7.5 newtons okay so so that's the tension okay now for part B uh, to find the mass now we could use this equation now that we know the tension we can find the mass uh, using that equation so we have equation 1 telling us equation 1 tells us 3t is equal to mass of the person plus mass of the scaffold plus mass of the bucket times g okay so the sum of the masses are 3t divided by g which is 3 times 4443 newtons divided by 9.8 meters per second squared Okay, so the sum of the three masses are a hundred and thirty six kgs. Okay. And so the mass of the bucket is 136 kgs, 136 kg minus 80 kgs minus 40 kg. This is 80 kg and that's 40 kg, so 16 kgs. So the mass of the bucket is 16 kgs. All right, that finishes this problem.